So my name is Julian Katzke. I'm a PhD student in the Biodiversity and Biocomplexity Unit here at OIST. I'm studying the evolution of ant heads, how they got to be all these different kinds of forms that we observe in ants today, and what are the parameters that led to this diversity. So in this picture, we're looking at a um, Strumigenes cacaoensis. What is so special about this ant is that it's evolved a kind of mousetrap mechanism. In this picture, you see the muscles that are involved in making this whole system work. The ant is a, is a fierce predator. What they uh, hunt for, they are called um, springtails. So the springtail, um, as an escape mechanism, it has evolved a so-called fulcular, just an extension on the behind of the springtail, and it can like latch it onto its own body and then release it like very quickly, and that results in a jump. And so the ant here has evolved this mechanism where you see its uh, long mandibles, so the, the main mouth part, and it can bring them wide open. And then there are um, trigger hairs, which you can faintly see in the picture, depending on the lifestyle of the ant. Either um, it really like actively hunts, or it just like waits still, the hairs get triggered, then this whole like system comes into place. The purple muscles, they move the lock called the labrum, and when the mandibles are open, they cannot physically close. The first thing that happens after triggering is that the lock moves out of the way. And then you see here in red on the picture are like the strong closer muscle. The trap shuts close and there is no escape anymore. What I worked on with the raw data is like, you can call it digitally dissecting. I mark what is the relevant anatomy and then later on I visualize it more so than any other images I've ever done that was like um, me like really um, working with the data and trying to highlight the morphologies. You see like the, the faintly outline, then like a solid, the, the right half of the head and then I also wanted to give it the eyes so that like the whole picture has more personality.